back. Great to be it's back. It's so happy Wonderful. to have you here. And uh, this is such a uh, this is such a, a cool show. This is a show where uh, you talk about your father mm -hmm. and you tell stories about him. You also read stories that he read to you when you were a kid, and then in turn, when he was older, you read to him. Exactly. So this yes. is a very personal show, a very intimate show. Yes, but uh, the stories are fantastic stories, and I begin reading them, but then I perform the hell out of them. <laughs> I pretty much do everything I can possibly do as an actor. Well, that's a fantastic uh, way to spend a couple hours, but you, again, because this is more personal, uh, obviously you've been on stage a lot on Broadway. You're going to have people who are talking during shows. Uh, oh, you, uh, and, and you recently had an issue where you had to, to stop the yes, show? Yes, yesterday your producer was in the audience. It was... <laughs> It wasn't him. There, <laughs> Thank I, God. <laughs> I walked out to very nice entrance applause like that. As soon as the applause died down, I haven't even begun yet. Right in front of me in the first row center, there was a fellow talking just about as loud as we're talking right now. I, I, I don't want to go to Sardis again. I always go to Sardis. And it was like, wait a minute. And he kept on talking. I, I was talking and he was talking. And all I could think was, I have two hours to go. <laughs> yeah. What am I worth? And I said, all I could do was say, is there anything I can do to help here? <laughs> is there a problem? <laughs> because only one of us can talk, you know. And the audience was on my side. I, that, I would imagine. <laughs> I would imagine. <laughs> so, but no one, it was, it no was one said, let him talk, John. <laughs> He's got to figure out a meal after this. <laughs> That's right. Uh, you've obviously had that happen over the years, being on stage a lot. Yeah. Uh, you, you had a, a sort of a heroic, I mean, obviously it was very heroic for the people in the audience last night, but you yeah. went above and beyond one time. There was actually, it was quite a beautiful moment. I, I was in this wonderful play, M. Butterfly, in the late 80s, in which I played... I constantly talked directly to the audience. I went in and out of scenes. And uh, there was a scene where a, a, a dance was going on. I was simply watching it. And I noticed a woman, an old woman, again, in the front row center. That seems to be the key seat <laughs> yeah. in all my stories. They, the ushers go, you look, yes, like, right. you look like trouble. Let me put you in the front. Yes, exactly. <laughs> yeah. She was struggling to her feet and trying. She must have been in her 80s trying to make her way to the, to the aisle. And as soon as the dance started and I began to talk to the audience again, she was still standing there. I said, Is, can I help you? Is there something wrong? Once again, she had to be brought to the aisle, laying down on her Holy back. Goodness. The EMTs came in to take care of her. The audience went completely silent. Word got to the house manager, to the stage manager, to me that she was all right. I told the crowd. They started to applaud. I said, quiet down. <laughs> it must have taken about five minutes. Oh, wow. And they, they, she was indeed all right. But, you know, as years have gone by, like a dozen people have told me they were in the audience that night and they'd never seen anything more theatrical. <laughs> you know? but, but then, is it true that you uh, also ran into her son? Is oh, this... yes. I, I didn't run into him. I was doing a Q&A at the Mu Museum of Broadcasting, TV and Broadcasting, and doing, answering questions from the audience. A gentleman got up without a question, but he had a letter. And he read it out loud. It was a letter from me to this old woman <laughs> years before, saying, I'm so sorry you missed the rest of the show. Please come back as my guest and come have tea with me. He, and he told the audience that I had done this. <laughs> and I didn't remember. <laughs> and I was like, I, I, all I could say was, what a nice guy. <laughs> <laughs> <It> was, <laughs>